So guys, it's not every day sleek cars, gari tamu tamu, luxurious whips. Sometimes we're gonna take it down to earth, be a little bit more in tune, a little bit natural. Today with me, we've got a delicious Defender. It's a Defender 90. And on my right, I've got O3 uh, Mazda Demio. This is my baby, okay? Telling you why we're out here today for the Sakasiri event, all right? What we're gonna be doing is looking for clues, playing the game, you know, having fun. With me, I've got my homie, Ted. Hey, brother. Well, go on. Hey, Zippy. Yeah, Zippy. How you doing? I'm feeling good, bro. Karibu Moto suit. Santi Sana. You get the chance to, to whip around with my little girl, man. Uh, she's lovely, bro. She's I'm really loving her. She's a cutie. <laughs> she's a cutie. Proper. Yo, how are you feeling about Sakasiri? Sakasiri. Have you seen the clues? Bro, it's a madness. Bro, you actually have to know things. It's, it's, it's a madness. I don't even know. I've, I don't even live in Karen. Yeah, bro. especially for people who don't live in Karen. Like that. They're going to struggle. But I think, I think we got this, bro. Yeah, 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 for sure. No doubt. Ah, those guys? Try and keep up. Those Try and guys? Keep up. Ah, for sure. Ah, okay. <laughs> I've got a turbocharged three liter over here. Hey, don't, don't, don't mess with the little girl, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> and uh, when you see these things, these are guys who are participating in the event. Okay. So without further ado, let's go and let's go look for some clues. Come lounge and drive straight to Bagadi Bridge. Where we locate our first clues, let's talk a little bit about the Defender 90. This is a two door pickup truck. Oh, I think that's a modification because I don't know, naturally, these ones aren't produced like this. We got it from our good friends over at Car Store. This unit is for sale if you're interested in it. It's kind of nice, it's a very powerful turbocharged engine, turbo diesel. It's a very capable, powerful, on and off roader. Gets a thumbs up from me. How far are we going, um, co pilot, sir? Very small key that can open a heavy door. Huh. We're deep in the woods of Karen, a wonderful suburb in Nairobi. Wow, oh, that's a nice house. Oh, there it is. Oh yeah, we found it. This is the little key that can open a big, a heavy door. Driving through this current suburb reminds me that I just want an easy life. I just wanna have things at your convenience, do things at your convenience, go places, meet with your friends at Hunters, eat some delicious pork. Something simple, not basic, simple. A kini defender maze. Uh, it reminds you that nothing will be given to you. You need some form of grit. You need some form of challenge just to, to polish you a bit, to open your mind. To give you a wider perspective. So that even when you attain those levels of ease and comfort, you don't stay there. Because then you'll start to slip. But just to remember that, you know, to get to a certain place, you have to shift some certain gears. You know, I've always wanted a Defender 110. And this is the closest I've gotten to one. And I think it's a beautiful car, man. I love the... <laughs> I love the experience of driving one. Maybe not this one in particular. But it definitely feels like a fun car to drive. A lot of people like to just look at it as it passes. The engine sounds really nice, well tuned. So props to this one for that. 
And it's got that prestige, it's got that old car smell. Just makes you feel like this is a very beautiful, precious gem to be owning and driving. You just have to have Ugali every morning. Because it's not a joke. Driving this car feels like a labor of love. Like you really have to love it to drive it because there's no way you can subject yourself through this every single day. You'd even be scared to go out on a road trip. Well, not scared, but you know, you definitely give it more than one road. The side profile of the Defender 90 is pretty straightforward. It's a rugged vehicle, so you can see it's rough and tough. You've got some storage compartments over here for your camping or off-road activities. You have a very massive boot, right? This is ideal for farmers, for ranchers, you know, guys who are doing extra activities. It's comfortably sitting on 16-inch alloys. They're quite big and you can see the Desert Hawk tires. Massive over there for proper grip and stability on the road. Over here, I love the rear end. I like how it looks. It's very rugged, man. It's almost military spec, if I'm not wrong, man. Uh, your rear door opens this way and it's very easy to load and offload stuff because the height isn't too much. Such a solid build. You've got a specked out exhaust and when you rev the engine, it's beautiful. Not only is it specked out over here, the real exhaust is inside and it's not just a uh, fake exhaust tip. You've got your trailer hitch over here for towing. This vehicle can tow easily north of 5,000 pounds over to the driver's side. You've got some more storage space, which is just the same as the other. You've got a slot over here for inserting a pole, maybe if you're out camping. Uh, the handles are pretty old school. <laughs> that's how you open it, and that's how you close it. If you don't hear that sound, it's not from the 80s. You've got your manual rear view mirrors. You operate them manually, there's no automation for this. I love it. You have a snorkel. Uh, this car has a wading depth of at least 60 inches. And over to the front. This is the favorite part of the car for me. Now obviously this is a restored version. It's modified, specked out. You've got this very rigid, strong aluminum bull bar. You've got the Defender badge, so that you know what car it is. This is a 1994 version, but it's got some modern headlamps that have LED uh, capability. You've got your parking lights and your indicators and some fog lamps down below as well. And you've got your long range antenna, which is great for in forest communication. But I want you to pay attention to some of these details because this is definitely a military spec uh, defender. You've got so many nooks and crannies, compartments over here for air on that side as well. You've got these little pockets where you can stash stuff, you know, when you're out there in the, in the wilderness. And I just love the hard body, rough and tough look of this Defender 94. Now, it's a pickup. Do you guys like it? I don't know, I'm 50-50. One, you can't trap with the homies. That sucks. But if you're a farmer, if you're into agribiz or whatever, you, you move a lot of construction, this would be a definitely good car to look into. We're here outside Bikram Lounge with the organizer of Saka Siri, the lovely Ivy. Thank you so much for having us for this event. It's been super. What do you think uh, of it? This turnout, your, your, your guests, everything. The turnout was good yeah. for our second event. It was, it was our second event. Um, I'm glad we made some clues hard. Because when it's too That's easy... That's an understatement. <laughs> it's not an understatement. When it's too easy, like everyone will be a winner. Mm. Mm. And mm. Some people deserve to lose. Yes, and then remember, the guys who came for the first one, they've come for the second one. If you, if you continue with the easy clues, it's very easy for them. Like if you, like for example, if there's an 
LG billboard and you say life life is good. Yeah. People know that's LG. Yeah. yeah. So, so the more the person attends <coughs> events, the easier it gets for them. Ah, so you have to make the clues tough. Take it from me guys, it was a challenge. Like you actually had to have a brain for this one. When you only come now, my passenger princess Mazena Joa Meumia. No lie. Mm -hmm. uh, Askez came with a lovely defender. Mm -hmm. What do you think about this car? I think it's sexy. Okay. I like, I like doing road trips. Mm -hmm. So this would be good if I want to go to Tamburu. You know, those places that I've always dreamt to go. Yes. Tamburu, Uko, Northeastern. You know, those long journey trips. Balimbali too. Uh, Balimbali too. But I'm not sure if it's my day to day car. You yourself, are you a car girl? Yes, I like car. Okay, I like Formula One. You like Formula like One? Cars. Okay. But not at the end. Mm. No, no, no. Mm. Juju too. Neza kuwa ju, neza spendi prado. Which Kenyan says such a thing? Yeah, spendi prado. So, siju kari ko juju wa bani ko dinari. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, would, you, would you buy this car? Would you buy it? Is it the kind of car you'd honestly just say, I'm spending money on this? When I'm filthy rich, it can be like my second car or third car. Okay. It can be my first car. So, you're ni abadaye ni ambeleni? Yeah, ni abadaye ni ambeleni. Because I assume ni car 10 million. You'd actually be surprised. Uh -huh. Take seven off of that. Three mics. Imagine, just there about. My this is 2K, Ivo. Ah, you guys, you're serious? No, this, I'm this, very I'm serious. About this. It's three mics. Or you keep Imagine. No, so now I mean, we're looking at next joking. year or something. I'm not, why would I, I feel be like you're joking. No, no, no. Okay, then I don't need to be filthy rich. It can be my second car. Summer on the way. Mm, on the way. On the ah. way. On the way. <laughs> on the way. <laughs> Manifesting. Mm -hmm. All right, that was awesome. Um, one last thing for the Moto Suit audience, Saka City guys who come, what would you like them to know about Saka City? Where are you guys going with it? So with Saka City, we are planning to have more events. Yeah. Like the Miz. So the Miz currently is a, it's a Moto Miz, so you need to have a car. Mm -hmm. But we are looking at, uh, we are planning always I mean, uh, a Miz, it mm. can be the Moto and Moto every quarter okay. but what we're looking at is also coming up with an idea where we do a maze where it's just by foot so we, sit, we get like an area like this and no cars are involved mm. like individual teams but with no cars involved so guys don't hide behind their engines we really test how you are as a person <laughs> okay. but the, the maze is you can be as fast as possible precision is key precision is key it's true yeah. it's true habari ndio here we look out for the next event and the event after that um good job Thank you too. Thank you for coming and good job. I, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Absolutely. Yes. Okay, guys, that's Ivy. Check her out on. Do you have socials that you want to yes. share? Yes. Um, on Instagram, Sakasiri underscore. Uh, Facebook, the same, Sakasiri. Yeah, I think we are on those two platforms. Yeah. TikTok coming soon. Yeah. It's been real, guys. Until the next one.